Hey there friends. Okay, let's talk about technique 17, which is rolling hooks. So a hook is very often is, is the part of the story that gets people in, right? Right back in the first technique video, we talked about asking questions, creating questions in the minds of your audience. And that is the way that we bring people into stories, we get them interested, we keep their attention. Um, but keeping their attention, of course, um, that really relies on, on what I call creating rolling hooks. In other words, um, you might have a big story kind of question. And that, if you've seen the video for the story triangle, that's very often, um, you know, the character and the conflict can kind of create a story hook, a big story hook. Um, but all the way through your story, you want to be having little hooks or rolling hooks, as I call them, because that helps keep interest. Um, so soap operas do this all the, all the time, um, obviously, you know, they, they never, they never finish a storyline without starting another one. Um, and the hooks keep on rolling and that's the way that people can watch, you know, a series about the same characters or the same place three or four or five times a week and, and never get bored because there's always new story questions being asked. And, you know, I think that's something we can, we can do quite powerfully in, in our, um, in our work. And in fact, even I just talked about the story triangle video and that in a sense is a kind of rolling hook because, because what, well, because all this stuff forms kind of a web, um, all these techniques form kind of a web, you know, I quite often in these videos, you'll have seen me refer to another video or another story in that thing. And that is, I guess, you know, it's very gentle, but it's a rolling hook. And if you take something like the uh, the thrillers that I write, well, if you've got a book of 120,000 words, um, you know, every, you know, really, you need something that's going to ask a question at the end of each chapter, because we need that forward momentum in our stories. Um, and, uh, you know, in 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 my work, you know, very often in a conversation, each beat of the conversation is kind of a question. You know, there's the dialogue and there's the there's the, the sort of surface meaning and then there's the underlying meaning. Anyway, the point is, I suppose, that when you're thinking about your stories, um, keep think. you know, it's not just one question we're asking or we want the audience to be asking. We want them to be asking questions all the time. So you can lace these little hooks through your stories um, and just it really helps keep the momentum rolling. Okay, that's technique 17. Technique 18, which we'll be talking about next, is how to slow down time. Ooh, see you in that video.